Hello, I'm Mary Lou Razaza, Supervisor for Central Supply at New Bolton Center. This is a video with regards to how to refold your surgery gown so that you can practice numerous times. All right, so now you didn't feel quite comfortable putting this gown on and you want to practice some more. So I'm going to show you how to refold your gown so that you can do this over and over and over numerous times. The thing that you don't want to do if you're going to refold the gown is you don't want to break these ties. So you untie it here. If somebody can come and get you out of the gown without breaking the ties, that's definitely a good thing. And then you can pull the gown off. Now, say one hand comes out and one hand is down. Now you want to refold this. So first thing, first thing you want to do is make sure that the arms are out of the gown. Shake it a little bit, okay? The second thing you have to do is you have to replace the tie that was in the front of the gown and that, and that card that was on there. Now that card probably broke. So if you have another piece of cardboard handy, you can actually make yourself another card by just putting two small holes in it. And then attaching your ties to the card. Any piece of cardboard will do. Okay, again now to refold this properly, these arms have to be outside of that tie. Like this. At this point, at this point, you have, you're holding the top of the gown, and you shake everything down. You're going to fold the gown in half, working at the top the inside middle of the gown. You're, so you're going to fold the gown inside out. You're once again then going to fold the gown lengthwise, going down the outside and looking for the inside middle of the gown where it's folded. And again, you're going to shake it down. That shakes the arms down inside, inside the gown. So inside middle of the gown is facing you, the fold is on top, you're going to lay it on a long table somewhere, flatten it a little bit, and now what you're going to do is you're going to fold it lengthwise once again. And paper has a memory. It pretty much, if you're doing this correctly, it will pretty much fold itself. These little ties can just go in somewhere. Now, what you need to do at this point is flip it over because now you're going to fold it into fourths similar as it was in its surgery package. And when you flip it over one more time, there again is the inside middle of the gown with the ties at the neck at the top, which actually you can tuck inside, and you're ready to start again.